Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Near Automata. I'm Zinker. He's Derek. All yeah. right, Derek. Imagine how we're mouth sore body, bodies, yeah. bodies, bodies, yeah. bodies, bodies. Uh, yeah. Um. So, let me tell you what happened. To, so I've been sick. Mm. Um. Just as we started recording, we happy few, which is uh Tuesday, which is about uh five days ago. I got really sick that day. Um, actually, pro possibly the day before, too. I don't think so. I think it was that Tuesday I got sick. Um, I've, uh, so then I got... Uh, I'm getting progressively sicker and sicker and sicker. Thursday, I, you know, I, I also, I should know, I picked up doubles at my work. Mm -hmm. Basically, like, I picked up so many shifts trying to get, like, 56 hours. Uh, which I did. Oh, wow. I think I've worked, like, 51 or 52 hours this week. Um... But I did this when I was well and good and I was sick, so like I was miserable. But um, what happened Thursday was so awful. Um, I've never rushed away from work so bad. And um, my teeth in the right side of my mouth by where my wisdom teeth was, mm -hmm. where it is, uh, sorry, um, was the most intense toothache pain I've ever felt. Now, I'm a very strong person. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not like my teeth haven't hurt before, but usually it's like nothing. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, this was incredible pain, dude. Like I was near tears. I was so miserable. Mm -hmm. It just ran. I got like subway between four and five, mm -hmm. and then from like four fifty p.m. onward, it was just pain that was getting more and more and more and more intense. And I was doing everything in my power again to yeah. stop it. Um, it was just, I was so miserable. I would sit there. I was trying to rush through my breaks. I was sitting there. Mm -hmm. I was in pain. I was, like, near tears. I, I couldn't focus on anything but the pain. Yeah. It was super intense. Um, no, I get it. I was also it there. Was uh, it, it was awful. It was awful. Yeah, so go for, ahead. So, for, for me, it was, uh, it was a couple of days ago. Um, I felt a... Uh, like, the back of my mouth kind of started, sore, like, being sore. Same side, too. Same back... back far back of like my right the right side of my mouth and i was I worried it was something related to my right wisdom side. teeth uh and i like looked um i like kind of felt around where it was and like i looked at um and i eventually like deduced oh like because it started hurting a lot more lately or recent or after a little while like a <laughs> significant amount also at 9s is a little hurt well um, that guy died <laughs> fast yeah he's, he's not he doesn't feel so good oh wait i have to i have to fight things Ow, okay. Was, you gonna continue what you're yeah. talking about? Yeah. So. Um, yeah, Derek, you gotta do what I do. Focus on talking and the gameplay. That's fine. This is a, this is still a tutorial part. It's easy. Uh, okay. I, it's hard to lose. Is what I shouldn't be saying. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> um. um and, anyhow. Uh, the uh, so um, yeah, like the back started hurt, was like hurting, and I looked in the mirror and I noticed there's like a white like like weird like almost like vein looking thing like in the back of my mouth uh, just above where my wisdom teeth are uh which is how i know it's not my wisdom teeth i think it's just a canker sore um just a really bad one but um i was in a similar position where like the one night like it started hurting really bad uh to where like and it was uh, for one thing it was just fucking hot here it's been fucking hot the last like week and a half since uh -huh. i've been back it's every night it's been so hard to sleep yeah, it got really cold and it got like super humid and hot again. This summer has been fucking brutal. I hate yeah. it. I have two fans on me right now because I'm dying yeah, so much. Yeah, I will get to the fan story probably next episode after we get for the teeth story. Yeah. But, um, so uh, yeah, uh, mine's just mouth. It's not teeth. Um, and uh, mine's so, mouth. Too. But that it's night, really but true, I don't think. that night though, I was in a similar position where I was like, like I can deal with a lot, like a, like a lot of oof, but like. <laughs> um, I was also in the point. I was at a point where a I couldn't sleep, which was just like stressing me the hell out because I hate that. Um, mm -hmm. And b, uh, I, like it just hurt so much, and I didn't have any pain medication or anything around. I ended up going. I ended up driving to. Well, I drove to Walmart at 4:30 a.m. I got mm -hmm. out of bed, like put some clothes on, and like drove, like drove to Walmart. Um, got there, saw that they didn't, that they were closed. Uh, you don't have a 24-hour Walmart? <laughs> yeah, that's. Me too, thanks. Um, wow. And uh, so I saw that they were closed, and then I was... Um, luckily, Wegmans is, is 24 hours. I did not dodge that. Um, oh, that was, like... That, that was such an easy dodge, too, Derek. Yeah, well, 
I, I tried. He to, could not have telegraphed uh, that attack more, or I, been more effect, ineffective with that attack. Same I, with that laser, really. I, I didn't realize he was. I wasn't paying attention <laughs> that much. Um. Anyways, so uh, the um, like, what? Luckily, Wegmans was open, and I was able to get some like medication to fall asleep. These last like three or four days, at least, um, mm -hmm. I've just been. I've been on painkillers at like pretty much all times. Um, really? Yeah. Uh, it's it's fine now. We're like I, like I'm okay, okay. now. Um, yeah. But um, it's it's getting better. Like it's not hurting nearly as much today as it was before. But like just to eat anything was like severely painful. Um, and like oh, just every so hard. often it would just like every so often it just like be like intense pain all of a sudden. And I, I couldn't really get to go away. Um, so I think I had it worse than you. Um, to be perfectly honest, because let me t put it this way: uh, at work, I took Advil and it did nothing. I like two tablets of Advil. <laughs> it had absolutely zero effect on That's this right, pain. That's right. There's a giant laser there. Um, I uh, I was taking. <laughs> I may have been taking more than I was supposed to. Really? It was damn. Okay, so I have a very re my body's always been really resistant to med to medication or anything in general. Like I know True. I've mentioned before how, but uh, still, like it that's kind of dumb. I didn't take that like could have been bad. I didn't take an irrational amount. I just took like slightly more than I was than I should. Um, that is an irrational amount. And like I stopped doing that too. I did I I did it for like the first like day or two. Um, I did it like immediately, is what I should say. Um, Anyhow. Uh, the only way I could get the pain to stop is I drove home, I rushed home, mm -hmm. I grabbed my toothbrush, and I brushed my teeth. Oh, I've been drinking mouthwash, too. Uh, uh, oh, dr helps. drinking? I haven't been spinning <laughs> out. I've been, I've been, I've been drinking Okay, let me, let me rephrase that. <laughs> I've been... I've, I've been using mouthwash as as a coordinate, or as directed. Uh, I should do shit. I should get some mouthwash, too. Yeah, it, um... Yeah, that that usually helps with such things but I'm gonna I'm gonna have to go to the dentist um but uh no I brushed my teeth and it got pretty much mostly better um yeah. now it still hurt mm. like it still hurts now as I touch it I mean it mostly only if I touch it though mm. uh but it's like deal with pain like the pain is not it's not even bad mm. like I'm not I'm not on painkillers or anything I'm just uh, it's just like it's a little bit of pain and it's fine yeah um for me, but it, I get really concerned if I get food stuck in there, it starts to hurt. Um, mm -hmm. I think what I have is something that I don't really, I'm not really proud to have. It's like gum abscess, mm -hmm. which is like a gum infection because food gets stuck there. Oof, yeah, that can happen. Yeah, my, my gums, I used, to, I had a, uh, my gums used to, were really bad uh, before I went to the dentist over winter break last year. Uh -oh. Yeah. I, I haven't I, I haven't been to the dentist in a while. Mine's not on my gums. Might have so. to pay him a visit. I haven't been to the dentist in like two years, but cool. next time I see a dentist is not gonna be a fun day. <laughs> um, but it seems like it's being uh, rushed because whatever mm -hmm. this pain is, it's probably not good. I don't think I can dwell on it for too long. Um, also, if you weren't paying attention, there's three there's three more Goliaths like this, so we're 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 pulling out the black boxes. What are those? Uh, just give it a second. You'll, you'll see. Oh, they're killing themselves. That's possible. They are robots. They can. They have. The, they have the ability. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers. Really? They kill themselves? Yep. Then that's the game. Oh, it's not. No, it's not. Um. Oh, do we just start as like another version of them? Yeah, just, just they just they just download themselves back, like they were. Oh. They they make a like they made a request to use the black boxes, and they just download themselves here. Okay. Well, that seems like cheap. That's like a super good super power. Yeah, it's like Bender, Thank except God. not Bender. It's like Bender. Ben, Bender can't do that. Yeah, he's the one who can't. Dude, that episode was so great, though. Yeah, that's a really good episode. That's one of, especially that's for one of my favorite episodes because it's like uh, it, it focuses on Hermes and Bender, and mm -hmm. that's it. Um, it, I, uh, you know, I, I really want to do a show someday. Mm -hmm. Probably not on this channel, but like on a different channel, where uh, I just talk about like uh, good TV shows, so two good TV show episodes, I should say. Yeah. Um, 
because there's so many episodes I want to go over. Like half of them, half of what I want to go over, are like from uh, BoJack Horseman, but like, um, not undeserved either. I could think of like eight from, okay, like six from season four of BoJack alone, and I'm pumped for season five coming out in like eleven days from now. I already took time off work for it. <laughs> I've already planned. That's fair. Um, I'm so pumped for it. I'm so excited. Uh, and then I'm gonna have you watch it. We're gonna do a Spellcast episode on it, I think. Um, that I think that's gonna be the plan. Mm. So if you weren't watching what just happened, uh, mm -hmm. no, we're not gonna connect. Um, so if you weren't watching what just happened, uh, 9S, uh, there wasn't enough bandwidth for 9S to get. I gotta make sure I saved in the right save. Jelly nuts, lad. Um, <laughs> right. There wasn't enough bandwidth for 9S to send both of their datas back, so he just sent uh, two Bs back, and then he sent back like some of his, but not all of it. Oh. And this I, this makes two B upset. So is he like okay? Yeah, he just doesn't remember. Like he doesn't remember anything past when they met up. Like in that, oh. in that mission that just happened. Okay. Interesting. Uh. So, no. what was I gonna say? Um, what was I thought? Oh yeah, BoJack and all these shows. But I know I one of the episodes I want to talk about was Squirrel Jokes, with SpongeBob, because mm -hmm. that is a fantastic episode. Because there's a fantastic lesson in it. Yeah. Um. What else? I know I want to do Rick and Morty, Total Rickall. This is really just listing stuff I want to talk about, but yeah, uh, someday, someday I think I'll do it. Um, the model, model, I think it's called model uh, lethal infection, is the name of that episode from Futurama, and that's gonna be one of the ones I talk about because it's a really fantastic episode. Mm -hmm. Um, probably I don't know if it'd be I, I can't think of another Futurama episode I would even talk about to be honest. That episode's just really great in general. The lethal infection, I really like those episodes of media. Where they do something like weird and different, it's all like well, it's not always, but like mm -hmm. it tends to be some of the better episodes. So, like, um, I don't know if this is necessarily a great example because I don't remember if it's actually good or not. Mm -hmm. But uh, Adventure Time did a show, uh, did an episode called Mystery Dungeon, mm -hmm. and it stars like a lot of their side characters, like a lot of random side characters, which is Ice King, um, an elephant called Tree Trunks. Um, a robot they built who appeared in like four episodes prior called I think it was Nectar or Nectar Nectar I don't remember his name um maybe Bimo I don't know if Bimo was in it uh Bimo's like a main reincarnation character so was Ice King though to be fair but uh mm -hmm. like uh still like they put, bring all these side characters again like wow an episode just on side characters I have to watch it and I did and I don't actually remember if it was good or not um been a while but you know stuff like that where it focuses on that i think is our you know it, it gives more in depth to these characters you don't know as much about mm -hmm. i think is what uh is really good and i think that's why the hermes and bender episode looks so good because you explore bender's backstory it feels like a story about bender but it's really a story about hermes and we don't really know much about him besides his wife cheats on him mm -hmm. that's it that's that's the only joke with him I think they ever used in that show. Yeah. Um, I can't think of anything else. And that he's like a fucking good, like, beer cat, whatever that means. Yeah. Um, but still. So, I, I don't know. Um, I do like that. Uh, and yeah, I don't know if I... Oh, I, I don't think I mentioned this about the tooth stuff, though. Uh, I now bring my toothbrush to my work. Hmm. Just in case I get food stuck in there. That way I can get rid of the pain. That's right. Um, can you hear? Yeah. The, can you hear the people outside? I heard like a one scream. I think. Okay. Well, there's people outside. <coughs> Anyhow, it's like Simon's belt. Mm -hmm. 